Hello. Uh, my name is Wilbur, and I like to travel to different dimensions. Could you please come with me to the other world beyond, and we can possibly return. Uh, ho hold on tight, just like me. Hold on, and don't be afraid to experience a uh, connection. A journey involves acceptance of other energies that don't always agree. So we must accept our differences and choices in a journey. We are going to experience different kinds of spirits. Not all the same, no, no, no. So please be patient and come with me. I would like to be your guide. And I thank you very much for your patience. <laughs> Thoughts and imagination are responsible for everything that happens. Thought is energy. They are like seeds. They grow and become powerful. Your thoughts pass and affect other people. The power of your mind is part of the creative power of a larger collection of thoughts. Thoughts are also energy signals, like energy consciousness cannot be created or destroyed. It can only be changed from one form to another. As a living soul with a personality who can perceive and affect the material world, we are trans-dimensional beings, the living souls of the spirit dimension. All beings exist in the physical and the spirit dimensions. Consciousness continues and we choose how to evolve. We are multi-dimensional, we are much uh, more than the ego. <laughs> Do not stop loving the music. Music does 
not die. This is the bridge between life and death. Echoes pierce our hearts through the veil. <laughs> Mugsy, I didn't even know that I would see you again. You survived death, Mugsy. These humans will never understand us. You're a better friend than the people spirits. The circus life is much better here. You don't have to beg for treats here. Never. You'll never have to beg for a treat again. You don't have to bark because I can know how you feel more now than before. Stop it! No, it's just wonderful to be here with you, Muxy. Wonderful. Cause I couldn't dance in the earth plane I couldn't even take a walk But there is nothing gonna stop me now I'm possessed by a higher power I'm doing the eternal dance I'm transforming death into motion With a dancing heavenly body And just like the earth goes around the sun I got my own creation Cause I couldn't dance in the earth plane No, I couldn't even take a walk but there isn't a thing gonna stop me now I'm possessed by a higher power And I'm doing the eternal dance I'm transforming death into motion With a dancing heavenly body Yeah, and just like the earth goes around the sun I've got my own creation I'm doing the eternal dance To love and be loved Fear not Allow yourself to love and be loved Fear not Allow yourself to love and be loved Fear not Allow yourself to love and be loved. I can't find the word. Try to understand I cannot change What I've done uh, uh, Please Try to understand I am confused So confused I should have made other choices but I felt an unease I couldn't trust I could not trust too much loss for me I, I can't see the light I can't see the light 
without the hope. It's too late to try. Now I don't deserve to find the light. I, I just don't know how. I want to stay here where I lived on earth. Please, please, please. I cannot leave here. It's what I know. I cannot leave, please. At one time, darkness and light were one, and later divided. They are two opposing forces of nature. On Earth, light has been separated from dark. Light can be immortality, and darkness is chaos and the underworld. We can choose lightness or darkness. Light can mean everything working in harmony. Contrast of light and darkness represents the moral opposites of good and evil. Our response to darkness can define our journey. We can find the light inside the darkness. You cannot have light without the dark. Opposites give each other meaning. When we are arguing about differences, we are often arguing different expressions of sameness. If we present a choice highlighting a loss, we will see it negatively. If we present a choice as a gain, we will see it positively. Become one with the light. Your spirit is brave. Your spirit is mighty. Your spirit is courageous. Your spirit is admirable. Your spirit is tenacious. Your spirit is resolute. Your spirit is energetic. Your spirit is essential. Your spirit is enthusiastic. Your spirit is mighty. Your spirit is powerful. Your spirit is animated. Your spirit is vital. Your spirit is passionate. Your spirit is eager. Your spirit is vigorous. Your spirit is compassionate. Your spirit is bold. The duality of good and evil is a choice. For choice to exist, we must face our own duality. Good coexists with evil. There can be no thing such as good unless there is evil. Calling action good or evil is based on one's perception and judgment. The absence of light cannot be called darkness, so the difference between good and evil is not absolute, but relative.
Our birth is but a sleep and forgetting. Our birth is but a sleep and a forgetting. The soul that rises with us, our life's star. The soul that rises with us, our life's star. Hath had elsewhere its setting. Hath had elsewhere its setting. And cometh from afar. And cometh from afar. Not an entire forgetfulness. Not an entire forgetfulness. And not an utter nakedness. And not an utter nakedness. But trailing clouds of glory. Do we come from God? Who is our home? But trailing clouds of glory, do we come from God? Who is our home? Heaven lies about us in our infancy. Heaven lies about us in our infancy. I cannot run from myself. I disappeared in my life and I am sick. I am a fugitive and have to be punished. I forgot my first love long ago. I don't talk about higher power. Don't. Turn down the noise, I can't bear it. No loving power would let a disaster like me happen. I'm not to be forgiven. I cannot be forgiven. I'm not letting go of my past. No, go away, go. No, go away, go. Turn down the noise, I can't bear it. No, go away, go. I cannot. This stick comforts me. One foot follows the other. But which foot is my best foot? I've got smart feet now. I don't think about the past or the future. I just hold on tight to my walking stick and take one step at a time. I need this stick. It gives me stability. One foot follows the other. But which foot is my best foot? I used to get stuck all the time. But now I've got smart feet. I don't think about the past or the future. I just hold on tight and take one step at a time. Just one step at a time. My soul is deeply dwelt in my bones, and I'm never letting go. I coexist with death. My injuries don't go away. They were the hands of my enemies, and now my hand is your enemy. It can find you anywhere. 
I will bring you down to the bottom of all the depths of misery, and you will never return. <sighs> I'm an angel falling into pandemonium. I can't bring myself back up. I can't bring myself back up. I left my great teacher and I'm not even worthy of the faintest amount of love. Of the faintest amount of love. They try to help me. They try to care. But I just cry for rain. I just cry for rain. To wash my soul and relieve my guilt. Oh, relieve my guilt with the magic energy of rain. But there is no rain and I have to learn. Oh, I have to learn just to heal myself. Oh, yeah, to heal myself. I was an impulsive boy who caused havoc for earthly creatures. I was fierce. I was angry about this love thing. I brought about misplaced desire with my arrow. So spirits would pursue the first thing they set their eyes on. And this gave me twisted joy. But then it caused my own misery. When I saw spirits suffer, I, I became dreadfully sorrowful because I was shown by higher spirits how I caused suffering. And I wished desperately for an end to my own pain. But the only way for me was to develop a new muscle inside of me called compassion. I have to work on this muscle so it expands more and more and more. I have to try to send love that is compassionate. Now, it's joyful for me to use my arrow. It's natural. And to see people unite in real love. shape our reality, we can explore our true spiritual identity and enhance our journey. We can experience a bold quest for answers and achieve a vision of our continued life. We live in a thought-responsive environment. We can expand our thoughts and let our inspiration guide us. We are powerful, creative beings. A consciousness can pass between dimensions in life and after death and communicate with spirits. All beings exist both in the physical dimension and the soul dimension. The deceased contact loved ones to give guidance and protection. We can connect to the soul hyper dimension through heightened states of consciousness and dreams. When we die and come through this veil, our consciousness continues to exist in 
the hyper dimension as a living soul with a personality who can perceive and affect the material world. We are trans dimensional beings. We are the living souls of the spirit dimension. We welcome interactive communication. And I thank you very much for your patience. See, there's nothing to be afraid of. There's always more to learn. And we learn as we grow. Every time we travel. So, well, I hope you learned. Bye for now.